affirmative. Destroy them. A little help would be nice. What? I can really use some help here. Of course. How about some assistance? Right. How about some assistance? Duh. I can really use some help here. Yes. How about some assistance? Stay near me. Of course. A little help would be nice. Sure. I could really use some help here. I could really use some help here. Stay close.
here? That's no way to straighten your spine. This must be our lucky day. We get to play with the spider. Well, if it isn't two of my favorite psychos, Scorpion and Lizard, how are you kids doing? Always the comedian, aren't you, Webhead? Now, is that any way to talk to someone who brought you a nice new lily pad to sit on? He's a lizard, you moron, not a frog! Oh, well, how about you, Scorpion? You need a lily pad? Hey, Scorpion! Seeing the web slinger reminds me of how much I love to pull the legs off of spiders. Me? I just like to stomp them and watch them twitch. Are you guys making veiled threats? I can't tell. And I really think I should be in the loop on this. That's it! I've heard enough. Let's shut him up, Scorpion! So, you're here. Certainly. Destroy the human! Help me! Of course! So behind Help me! Keep together, team. I cannot defeat this one alone. Keep together, team. I need help. Keep together, team. Okay.
hast struck the great anvil and proven thyself worthy of the favor of the gods. Take this and fare thee well. Keep together, team. Destroy the humans! Keep together, team. Sure. Help me! Sure. I cannot defeat this one alone. Help me! Of course. Help me! Why not? Help me! By your command. I cannot defeat this one alone. Yes. I cannot defeat this one alone. I need help. I cannot defeat this one alone. I cannot defeat this one alone. Stay near me. I need help. Sure. Stay near me. Help me. Keep together, team. I do so enjoy victory. Okay. Thank you, and apologize to you. Long have I shown disdain for humans. Your people seemed weak and fearful to me. But now, it is humans who are rescuing the gods of Asgard. You have shown yourselves courageous and worthy of my respect. Allow me to create this portal to aid you in your travels. And now, I must be off to see what can be done to save Asgard. Until we meet again. Is that clear? Yes. 
Yes, my lady. A thousand apologies to you. Enough of this. Tell me why Doctor Doom wages war in Asgard. One of your precious team knows, or at least suspects. Impossible. How could one of us know Doctor Doom's plan? It is a very interesting story. Tell him nothing, my lady. We've wasted enough time. Let me destroy Thor. I have a better idea, my pet. Let us both destroy him. This will not go well. My friend, you have defeated the Enchantress and the Executioner. I would have not thought it possible. I can still stand, so I am well enough to begin the fight anew. Let Loki beware, for he has now truly earned my wrath. It will not be an easy fight for sure, but I will rally the gods and we will unshackle the beloved city of Asgard. I thank you again, humans. All of Asgard is in your debt. Now, onward to battle! Now that the Bifrost Bridge is open, and the gods have been freed in Asgard, we can turn our attention to locating Odin. The last we heard, Odin was heading toward Niflheim to battle the Frost Giants. I doubt he's in trouble. But just to be sure, your next mission is to go to Niflheim to see if Odin needs help. For more information on helping Odin, talk to Lady Sif. If you want to leave right now, take the well to Niflheim.
That password you gave me into Black Widow's account was perfect. I got all the info I need to prove she's a traitor. Well, sweet little Black Widow has traveled to Latveria several times in the last few weeks. And uh, get this, a large amount of cash was recently wired to her account. Now Fury's gotta believe she's working for Dr. Doom. I'm here. What was so important that we couldn't discuss it outside? Colonel Fury, we think Black Widow might be a spy for Doctor Doom. We found a laptop that belonged to Black Widow back on the helicarrier. It held detailed security information on a S.H.I.E.L.D. think tank known as the Imperium. We also discovered that large amounts of money have been transferred to her bank account, and she has recently made trips to Latveria. Why are you spying on my personnel when you should be focusing on the Masters of Evil? What's wrong with you, Fury? Didn't you hear a word they said? The Black Widow's selling the Imperium to Doom. You've got it all wrong. Doom broke into the Imperium a month ago and stole some very top secret plans. Black Widow had that laptop because she'd been given the job of upgrading the security there. But what about the money? and the trips to Latveria. I had sent her to Latveria in the hopes of bribing one of Doom's people to get back a particular plan he stole. What is so important about this particular plan, Colonel? It's called Operation Allfather. It was developed in case the Asgardians ever became a threat to us. It dealt with stealing Odin's power by using the Twilight Sword. So that's what Doom's been up to. He's out to become the most powerful god in Asgard. And you knew all along. I was never completely sure. Well, I think you can be now. I only hope we didn't find out too late. Agreed. We had best get to Niflheim quickly and save Odin before Doom is able to complete his scheme. Hey, uh, could you, uh, go talk to Valkyrie and, you know, see if she's interested in getting to know me a little better? Oh, please. If there's one thing I know, it's women. I've got, like, a sixth sense, and I'm thinking Valkyrie's got her eye on me. Uh, I've had enough of the place. Now that I'm done with this job, I'm splitting. <sighs> like I tell you, then Fury'd find out and he'd throw me in prison. <sighs> Once things have cooled down, I'll contact you for my pay. Don't I know it? So, are you ready for Niflheim? From what I've heard, it's quite an amazing place. There's a mountain there known as Raven Spire. It's supposed to be some sort of special zone where very powerful magic can be performed. It's a focal point of Asgardian magic. An average sorcerer could become very, very powerful while at the top of the mountain. I think everyone's about ready for Weasel to leave. Colossus came back late last night after a week-long trip to Russia. He found Weasel in the kitchen and wound up putting him through a wall. Karma managed to get between them and explain who Weasel was. Come back anytime, my friend. News of my father is most disturbing. We should leave for Niflheim immediately. Many would trust in his strength and say Odin cannot be defeated. Yes, with Loki involved, my father could be in great danger. 
There is no telling what the god of evil has planned. I have battled it several times, and it truly is invincible. The metal it is constructed of is harder than Uru. A mystical metal known only to Asgard. It is even harder than adamantium. My hammer, the Mjolnir, is constructed of it, as are several other enchanted weapons of my people. It was given to me by my father, Odin. It is enchanted so that only those it deems noble enough can lift it. My father had me endure many trials so that I would become worthy of Mjolnir. There were many times I would measure my success by seeing how far I could lift it from the ground. Yes, my father, the X-Man named Storm, Captain America, and Beta Ray Bill. An alien who, after a great many trials, became the protector of his people. He picked up my hammer not knowing its true power, and Milner deemed him worthy to lift it. You are welcome, my friend. I remember you. Weren't we on that one mission where we did that one thing against that one guy and we won? Oh yeah, me and Weasel go way back. I saved him from a life of drudgery, working at some high-paying job. Thanks to me, he's now hiding out in rat holes and dodging bullets as a mercenary of the Information Highway. Tell me about it. I mean, who needs a cushy job and security when you can have adventure and the promise of a short life? He's like the ultimate Boy Scout. Unless, of course, money's involved. He'd sell his grandma's walking cane for a buck. As a matter of fact, I bought his grandma's walking cane for a buck. Oh yeah, 100%. Maybe. A bit. No, he's probably making it all up. Ooh, wanna hear me play the 1812 Overture with my armpit? Your friend Weasel continues to stare at me. Interested. Romantically? Please, I just ate. This is absurd. How could a toad like that even think he is worthy of the affections of the great Valkyrie? In years gone by, I was able to gather warriors from Earth, but I was recently told we were no longer allowed to do that. It was by order of Odin, an order I do not agree with, but it is not my place to argue with the mightiest of the gods. I assume you are joking. I would sooner stick both hands in the mouth of Fenris as talk to that pasty-faced human. Nay, I say to you, he smells of greasy food and breathes through his mouth. I bid thee good day, human. I don't know about you, but I'm plenty steamed at fury. Why'd he leave us in the dark about this whole Imperium thing? Me? I've been a part of just about anything you could name. The Avengers, Alpha Flight. Heck, I've even been a horseman of Apocalypse. Oh yeah, the bad guys have managed to get their hooks into me a couple of times. The hand's been the most recent. They brainwashed me and turned me into an enemy of the state. I was running around attacking everyone I used to work with. Thanks to Fury, I got back to myself. Then, Electra and I went and paid the Hand a little visit, just to set things straight. No problem. 
Wow, talk about a mind blower. How could Nick have kept that information from us? How could he not tell us he suspected what Doom's plans were all along? Ah, we may take shots at each other, but it's all in fun. Johnny's a good kid, even if he is like a little yipping poodle most of the time. Nah, you got it all wrong. I love the little darling. I only get the urge to clobber him once in a while. No problem. Sure. Hi. Yes, when I was pregnant with him, I stepped down from active duty, and a crystal took my place in the Fantastic Four. She's one of the Inhumans. While Crystal was a member of the team, she was Johnny's girlfriend. But as things tend to go with my brother, it wasn't a long-lasting relationship. They were the results of the Kree having experimented on humans during our Stone Age. Their goal was to build an army of super soldiers to aid in the war against the Skrull. The Kree did succeed in creating humans with supernatural abilities, but they abandoned the experiment. And the Inhumans are the result. It was my pleasure. <laughs>